Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com. Today we're going to do a quick overview of the Android 2.0 operating system uh, and the differences between it and Android 1.6. Okay, one of the new changes comes in the form of syncing. So if you go to settings and then accounts and sync, uh, you can now add multiple accounts, not just your Google account, um, for email and contact synchronization. So corporate would include Exchange. So now you can sync with Exchange, Facebook, and Google. Another change would be contacts. Now when you go to contacts, their images are shown next to their uh, name. You can also click on their image to bring up different ways to contact them quickly. Um, call them, view their contact information, text them, and if you have an email, email them. This quick contact feature um, where you tap on their uh, image to contact them quickly also works within the messaging program and within email and calendar, which is pretty cool. Uh, some changes were made to email as well. Uh, not only does it now support Exchange, it also allows you to sync up multiple accounts and have them all show up in one inbox. Some changes to the camera were also made, uh, including adding digital zoom, scene mode, white balance, color effect, macro focus, and it also has built-in flash support, so manufacturers don't need to write uh, a bunch of drivers for their flashes to work on their camera. The browser also got some updated changes. Uh, it can now, it has a little bit better of a uh, user interface look. Um, it can also support double tap to zoom. And double tap to zoom back out. Uh, the URL bar itself can now be used not only uh, to go to pages, but it can also be used to search. So you can just type whatever you want directly in there and hit enter and it'll automatically Google search it for you. Uh, it supports HTML5 and it also has uh, thumbnail bookmarks. So if you click on bookmarks, you can see thumbnails of your bookmarks. Besides that, it adds uh, Bluetooth 2.1, improved graphics architecture so that you get improved performance um, and better hardware acceleration. Basically just means the phone runs a little faster. Um, we also have a, a new Android virtual keyboard that allows multi-touch support uh, so you can type a lot faster with two fingers. Um, a smarter dictionary that learns from word usage and automatically includes contact names as suggestions. Um, and just an improved keyboard layout to make things uh, a little bit easier. And that's pretty much all the major changes between Android 1.6 and Android 2.0. Um, and this concludes our Android 2.0 uh, quick overview.